Field is just on the other side. We're almost there. This is where we give them gravy! Let's put our powers together and get Pope Agnes out of there! Afraid I can't let that happen. Jan. I see you've made yourself some new friends. Even managed to dig up two warriors of light. Impressive. The Kaiser was right. You're proving a real thorn in our side. Guess I'll just have to take care of you before you cause any real problems. You know this man, you? He's my friend. Or was. Before he... Before he... No. I still don't want to believe it. Why? Tell me why, Jen. How could you betray us? I told you, didn't I? I made up my mind a long time ago. That was my plan from the beginning. Reduce the Crystal Guard to shambles. From the inside out. Think what you will of me. The wolf walks his own path. <laughs> now enough chit-chat. Let's get this over with. On your guard, you!
Jan, are you all right? Am I all right? <laughs> That's what you say to me? Your enemy? What a dupe. I'm just worried about you. <sighs> That's why you're a dupe. And you're about to get burned. Resurrect. <laughs> just like that. What? Took you long enough, old man. But I am here, am I not? Just as promised. Sir Nikolai! You're alive! I thought I'd never see you again! Nor I you, Master Yu. Yet I fear this will not prove a pleasant reunion for either of us. That is why I warn you, yes, twice, if I recall, to leave this battle behind you. Sir Nikolai... I had hoped to spare you the painful truth. But there is no point in concealing it any further. I, too, stand with the Empire. This... this can't be. That day in the Sanctum, you, you told me to live. Was it all a lie, Sir Nikolai? On the contrary, I meant every word. The last thing I wanted was for us to fight, Master Yu. That is why I feigned death as I did. Why I went to such lengths to persuade you to abandon this fight. Yet it seems my actions have had the worst possible outcome. This is of grave import, so I will say it once more for good measure. Master Yu, give up this fight. Ignore my advice, and we will have no choice but to kill you. Just as we did our comrades. Save your breath, old man. Once he set his mind to something, there's no change in it. So stop standing there like a dupe and let's finish this! Holder of the Fencer Asterisk! The Blazing Wolf of the Glance Empire! Jan on guard! And Holder of the Bishop Asterisk! The Empire's stalwart Oryx! Nikolai Nikolonikov! Jan... Nikolai... The Three Cavaliers... Our, our friendship... Was it all a lie? Ugh, what's so hard to get? Pull yourself together, you! That's right, you! We have a battle to fight! But I... You! We're with you! Right. I am Eugeniolja, leader of the Crystal Guard's Three Cavaliers! No. I am Eugeniolja, of Agnes's Avengers. And in the name of Her Holiness, I will strike you down!
You have grown strong indeed, Master Yu. Say your prayers! <laughs> Thank you.
This isn't looking good. What are you waiting for? Finish us off already. Jan... I can't. I, I just can't. <laughs> you never learn, do you? Falcon Claw! You! That'll have to do. Let's scram, old man. And so our paths diverge. Follow the path you will, Master Yu. Even if it means that we must meet again as enemies. So long, Yu. Try not to get yourself off before we meet again. A meeting. That's all it takes. The whims of chance bring you together. Eyes meet. A helping hand is extended. And the course of your life is altered. You laugh together. Cried together. You walk together down the hardest of paths. And then you had to say goodbye. But do not abandon hope. Life is full of new meetings, and every new meeting is the beginning of a new tale. And in this tale, these four will be your shining stars to guide you through your darkest night.
the sea grows angry. But nothing shall deter a swordmaster from his quest. Mark my words, Brave. You will be avenged. Patience, Tsubaki. We shall reach our quarry in due time. But first, we must hurry to the aid of my pupil. Let us be off! The Skyhold is gone. You? Those two were your friends? More than friends. Jan and Nikolai were my closest companions. We were the three Cavaliers, brothers in arms till the end of our days. But, at least, that's what I thought. You... Forgive me, everyone. The Agnes' kidnapping? My friend's betrayal? This is all my fault. Don't put the weight of the world on your shoulders like that, you. You've had it tougher than any of us. <laughs> Ikutumwa, you. No matter who turns against you, I'll always be here. Me too. After all, we're friends brought together by a common cause. Friends. Thank you. Nah, don't mention it. Now, who's ready to go kick some Imperial behind? Onyes, can you tell where the Skyhold's heading? Oh, well, no. That is... it's difficult to say. Can you see anything from the window? Anything that could give us a hint? Just the blue of the ocean stretching as far as the eye can see. Nothing but ocean. What's this? A flock of migratory birds? Birds? What do they look like? They're quite striking, really. With green feathers, red crests, and long pointed tails. That sounds an awful lot like the Harina Starling. Amazing, sir! Y you're a living, breathing field guide! And they seem to be flying south, or east, or is that west? <laughs> I see your sense of direction is as reliable as ever, Agnes. Forgive me. Oh, the air seems to be growing warmer and warmer. Agnes, that's a great help. Tell us if you notice anything else. I certainly shall. Now let's put together everything we know. The Skyhold has left Eternia for warmer climes. From the window, Agnes saw a flock of starlings. That can only mean one thing. The Skyhold is bound for the continent of Harina. There's an ocean between us and Harina. We're going to need a boat. Then we should go to the port in Gathladio. They'll have a ship for us there. <laughs> 